Greetings, all you lovely ladies and gentlemen of the internet. I am Flaming Raven, and welcome back, finally, to Undertale. If you guys did not know, uh, yeah, I played this game. I actually played it twice. And, uh, oh, hello, Papyrus. Shower, you came back to- oh! <laughs> Already? Alright, uh, maybe editing Alex can kind of tell you what's been going on. Yeah, allow editing Alex to hit you with that <clears throat> last time on Undertale. <laughs> nah, let me just hit you with that just real quick. Last time on Undertale. Nope. You thought. You know what's going on here, don't you? Groot wants to show you something. Let me try. I call it Dapper Blunk. <laughs> Yeah, do you like it? Hey, I like it. What are you doing? I am not fighting you. What's it look like? You've taught me not to fight. How are you going to teach me to not fight and then fight me? However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Oh, Torio. Turn around and shake my hand. That's not even my computer being slow. That's just him talking slow. All right, shake his hand. What the hell? Okay, you can go ahead now. Thanks for saying you the jungle just to appease my brother. This day he got stuck trying to solve the horoscope. Oh no. Okay, we got it. Oh no. <laughs> what the hell kind of hang on oh i can't even, yeah it's like an invisible wall what the hell kind of puzzle making welcome oh welcome to snowden welcome to snowden town we made it we got a shop and yes the sight of such a friendly town fills you with termination damn papyrus blocks the way in color <laughs> Act, Papyrus, flirt, insult, and check. Let's check him. Papyrus, attack 20, defense 20. He likes to say, nya ha ha nya ha ha Well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great Papyrus, I'd like to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Papyrus is sparing you. Thank you! <laughs> anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> okay, he just casually... Casually defies physics. Cool. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Oh. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yes. So you know all about it. So, you came back to have a date with me? You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Alright, where are you taking us, Papyrus? Where is there to even go around here? Is it gonna be Grillbees? Oh, is he gonna take us back home? Yeah. <laughs> My house! Oh, this is gonna be interesting. Hang on, this is loud as hell. Hang on a second. This is my brother's pet rock. 
He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. Oh. It's a dirt. It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not bring it back to my room? Forget it. <laughs> wow. Oh. Oh. All right. Damn, that's a tall sink. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. Oh, it's that freaking dog. Didn't he st What? Catch that meddling canine. Curse says. <laughs> Bruh. Sense. Stop plaguing my life with incidental music. Bruh. All right, yeah, run back here. Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please, pursue my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers, all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Wonders who those are. That's a trash can. Feel free to visit it any time. My brother always goes out to eat, but... Recently, he tried baking something. It was like a, qui a quiche, but filled with a sugary, non-egg substance. How absurd. There's an empty pie tin inside the stove. Oh, it's kind of like the pie tutorial made for us. All right. Uh. Ooh, it's my favorite game show. It says, stay tuned for a new program. MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. All right. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Oh, boy. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside, inside the quantum physics book was in their joke book. You look inside, there's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. I'm a dumbass, I don't get that, so... <laughs> okay, hang on. Oh, this is art right here. A classic image! It always reminds me of what's important in life. Bones? Alright, this is Sand's room, the door's locked. And it's burning. That's my room. If you finish looking around, you can go in and do whatever people do when they date. What do you mean by that? How old am I again? Oh! Welcome to Scenic My House. Enjoy and take your time. All right. <clears throat> that's my room. We finished looking around. We can go in and do whatever people. Okay, that's. Uh, I may have to do some censoring here. He's got a race car bed. And it got real quiet. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only less yesterday, even though it basically just happened. The internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. <laughs> of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona. Always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. Wouldn't have it to be Comic Sans, would it? Watch my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair? Sun on my skin? Of course, that's just a dream. So instead I cruise while I snooze. Ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for the theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa. Oh, I thought he was talking about Sans. Yes, yeah, so Santa. That book's one of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. <laughs> the ending always gets me. Isn't that flag neato? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world? Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Nyeh <laughs> He said thing! 
He said the thing! There are no skeletons inside my closet! Except me sometimes. Oh, papyrus. Look in the closet? Sure. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Great! Alright, I think that's all there is to see. So, um... If you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Begin the date? Oh, boy. Oh, wait a second! Oh, okay, dating start! This is one of my favorite- it has one of my favorite songs. Yep, wait. Oh, yeah! Uh... I for- Here we are, on our date! I forgot to mention, that's right, I have, like, a color thing that just adds color to the sprites. Just because I think it looks cool. So, I'm sorry if you don't like it, but... I've never- actually never done this before. But don't worry. I'm sorry, this song is amazing. You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. It's so loud. Step one. Press the C key on your keyboard for dating hub. All right. Crime? Population? Reel it in? Egg? Wowie, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step two, ask them on a date. Ahem. Human, I, the great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Oh, we'll, yeah, uh, we'll go on a date with you, uh, sure. Really? Wowie. I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That's been down around your head. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning! Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh god, did I kill him? No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No, no! Your dating powder! Oh, p powder? Power? Nyeh! Nyeh! <laughs> Yeah! Don't think you've bested me yet, Tension. I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will. <laughs> I can easily keep up with you. You see, I, too, can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Yeah. <laughs> what do you think of my secret style? I hate. No, I'm kidding. I love it. Amazing. No, no. A genuine compliment. I like this music, dude. I love the music. Oh. However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Move, in, uh, move and inspect with Z. What about them kicks? Human souls are stronger than monster souls, but the souls of our shoes, on the other hand, are about the same. All right. Them shorts. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance, and lots of milk, probably. What about that hand. Hold in my hand, so I'll tell you the answer. No, I must resist. What about this one? There's no secret to. M okay. Or she, I see. You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart. <laughs> but who doesn't? Uh... I see. Okay, yeah, caressing my biceps. Yeah, great. Uh, that shirt. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be res improved this way. Uh, what about your face? My hat? I didn't click that, but <clears throat> sure. My hat. My hat. Yeah. Well, well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Open it. Oh, it's spaghetti. Do you know what it is? Of course. Spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right? But oh, so wrong. This ain't my plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silken spaghetti. Finally aged in an oaken cask. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There is no way this can go any further. 
Eat it. You take a small bite. Your face reflectively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! Ah! Ah! No! <laughs> oh my god! Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. Whoa! Whoa, it's time for me to express my feelings. Whoa! Whoa! No, 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 no! It's time that I told you. Get the sensories ready. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy. Is it hot in here? Or is it just me? Get the sensors ready! Oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Damn it! <laughs> I'm kidding. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend. And act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic for you to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Thank God. Ugh! Because I don't even have lips. Yeah, that's... <laughs> and hey, someday, you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> Well then, that just happened. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. I got something out of this. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, I gotta go. <laughs> we got the number. Victory! <laughs>
Alright. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. Alright. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Oh, oh. A little longer than a few minutes later. Congratulations! You failed the puzzle. Screw you too, then. That. Hey! Alright. I got it. Ring. Hello! This is Papadis! How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. Nyahaha! <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a bandana. Is that true? Are you wearing a bandana? What will you say? Sure. So you are wearing a bandana. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. Click. Okay. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Wishing room. Oh. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Come on, sis, make a wish. Oh. Washua. Uh, clean. That's Washua to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Tweet. Green means clean. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, wait. Clean me. Ah. Washua is friends with, with a little bird. All right, spare him now. Yay. Oh, he kicked my ass a little bit. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. All right, hang on. Let me eat. No, wait, no. Oh, my HP does not. Item. Uh, let me just eat some ice cream. Is this as sweet as you? You recover 15 HP. Nice. All right. Look through the telescope. Yes. Oh. Oh, I can look around. Check wall. Uh. Oh. All right, hang on. There's more here. Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. Great. Oh boy. Oh. Yep. You're getting done for those. Ancient writings cover the walls. You can't. You can just make out the words. The War of Humans and Monsters. All right, hang on. <clears throat> can I go down here? No, I cannot. <clears throat> Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seems that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. They would take the soul of nearly every monster, just to equal the power of a single human soul. Oh. But in humans, but humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body, even after death. If a monster defeats a human, it can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Okay, oh. All right. Well. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, hold on. Wait. Ugh. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay. Oh, that's fantastic. No, 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 no. Wait. Down. There we go. Listen to him stomping. Ah, shoot. Woohoo! Ah! Run, 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 run. What? Bro, nope, I'm hiding. Nope. Uh-oh. How'd she get over here? Did she jump over that ledge? Oh. Oh, it's Monster Kid. <laughs> Howdy. <laughs> I'm just gonna put you down. Did you just give up like that? Did you seriously think that that's all I was? <coughs> was Monster Kid? Uh, hey, Monster Kid. Where did he go? There he is. 
Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. She grabbed me by your eye, dude. dude. I'm never watching my face ever again. Man, are you man are you unlucky? If you were just standing if you were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. Oh god, she broke his face again. Broke the face that freaking Undyne just touched. Okay, what's with the docks over here? Hey, this cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Alright. Squeak. Hey! Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crystal, it feels with determination. Squeak. I like that. Alright. Hey, what's good, Sans? Hang on. Use the box. Yes. Uh, give me a cinnamon bun, and maybe another cinnamon bun. All right. What are you? What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? I'm not sure about that one. Hey, buddy. I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can tr you can trade them for a free ice cream. You're sure to get the customers to come back. Nice cream, it's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 25G. Sure, I'll take another one. Super, here you go. Your card's in the box. You got the ice cream. Nice, all right. The ancient, the ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. Great. I'm thinking of, I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 50,000 G's to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Use a telescope? Sure. Okay, that's fantastic. Really? That's all it is? It's just red? Huh? You aren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. <laughs> oh my god! Sans, what did you do to me? Ooh, it's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Sure, you got the ballet shoes. What are those? Info. Ballet shoes. Weapon attack 7. They're... These U shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. Is that better than my current? Uh, weapon? Tough glove. Attack is 5. Okay. I'm gonna put the ballet shoes on. I guess. I don't know when I'm gonna have to- I don't think I'm ever gonna have to use them, but I just feel more comfortable with having them on. Just in case, like... Oh no. I don't know. Don't- Don't judge me. I wanna wear the ballet sh I wanna look like a pretty princess. Okay. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know. Her opinion of you is very... murdery. But I bet you knew that already. And because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. A bandana. Because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. It's such a smart cookie. This way you're safe and I didn't lie. Betrayal, no betrayal anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. Uh, I didn't change. I'm still wearing the bandana. The power to take their souls. This is the power that the humans feared. Um, hello? Hello? Tentacles? Oh my god. Hey, there. Noticed you were here. I'm Oni- I'm Onion-san. Onion-san, you're here. Oh my god, okay. That's- that's nice. You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. All right. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time. But, hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. That's sad. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. You're here. Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? 
Nice. Hey, there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In the waterfall! Nice. <laughs> Onion son. <laughs> oh! Shy Ren hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. Smile. You smile. You have to see Siren smile, too. Siren gets quieter in the corner. Aaron nods his head approvingly. Hum hum. Oh, smells like music. Oh, you want me to hum? You hum a funky tune, Siren follows your melody. See me, see me, see me, see me. Ow! Why? Much more comfortable, s much more comfortable singing along. Yay! All right, you won. Nice. The northern room hides a great treasure. There's a piano here. Play it. This power has no counter. Indeed, the, a human cannot take a monster soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power will be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There's only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster soul is strong enough to persist after death. If only for a few moments, a human could absorb this soul. But this has never happened. And now it never will. Huh. It's a statue. The statu the structures at its feet seems dry. Huh. Please take one. Take an umbrella, take one. You took an umbrella. Oh, wait a second! Oh, wait, I think I remember this. Can't you give one to the statue? Put the umbrella on the statue. Yes! You place the umbrella atop the statue. Inside the statue, a music box begins to play. Yay! And doesn't stop. <gasps> Wait a second! Oh! Oh! Let's go! What is it? It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Take it. You're carrying too many... Did I say dogs? What? I know... Oh my god. Annoying dog. Dog. A little white dog. It's fast asleep. Are you... You deploy the dog. The dog absorbs the artifact. The artifact is gone. Are you serious? Wow, you can actually see my reflection. That's cool. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Hey, let's go. Let's go. Hey, I like how you can see the reflection, dude. That's still cool. Man, Undying is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night, knowing she was going to beat me up. Haha. <laughs> Does he not know I'm a human? Well, I guess not all humans are probably yellow, but... So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undying came to school? She would beat up all the teachers. She could beat up all the teachers. That's... <laughs> nice. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Yeah. Ooh. What's this? Is that the castle? 
Oh, where are you going? Oh, all right. Dude, that's so cool looking. All right. Return the umbrella. Put it back. You return the umbrella. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Hey, you want to see on dying, right? Climb on my shoulders. Yay! Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. <laughs> he, he, he's he got to have a concussion by now. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. The serene sound of a distant music box fills with determination. Yeah, we're at the bridge now. All right. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken and countless monsters were turned to dust. Damn, they call Thanos? Uh oh. Oh god. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, you're back. Hey! 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 Nope. Too slow. Oh god. Nope. Alright. Nah. This way? Maybe? Uh. I don't know where I'm going. It's music, though. Ooh, you almost got me there. Okay, nope, not that way. Uh, which way? Which way am I going? This way, maybe? No, which way am I going? Where am I at? Nope. Is she getting faster? Uh oh. Yeah, she's 100% getting faster. That's time to go. She lost her mind. Move! Alright. Did I make it? Oh boy. Uh, do I have to go back? There's nowhere else for me to go. Oh, crap. I love how just unfazed I am by all that. It sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Raven, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Ooh, Lore. Oh, ooh. Piles of garbage. There are quite a few brands you recognize. Just garbage. Alright. The waterfalls here seems to flow from the ceiling of a cavern. Occasionally, a piece of trash will fall through and fall to the bottomless abyss below. Viewing this endless cycle of worthless garbage, it fills you with determination. <laughs> Brought trash zone? Piles of garbage? Yep, okay. A bike? You rest your hand on the rusted bike. Its horn wheezes a honk of despair. Just garbage. A beat up desktop computer. The inside is empty. Garbage. It's a cooler. It has no brand and shows no sign of wear. Inside are a couple of free dry space food bars. Take one? You're carrying too much. How? How? Do you. Dirty dishes left unwashed by a dog. Oh. You use the... You finished using it. An uneasy atmosphere fills the room. Can I drop it? 
The dog residue was thrown away. Thank you. Got the astronaut food. It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. Ah, the weebs. The trash heap. Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? No, why would I want to do that? You stare into each other's eyes for a moment. Why would I want to beat him up? He's not done anything to me. It looks like the one that Toriel made me hug. Oh. Hi? Ha ha ha, too intimidated to fight me, huh? I'm a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too, until you came along. When you talked to them, they thought they were in for a nice chat. But the things you said, horrible, shocking, unbelievable. It spooked them right out of their dummy. Human, I'll scare your soul out of your body. Hey, attack 30, defense, yes, because they're a ghost. Physical attacks will fail. Feeble, feeble, feeble! Oh, 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 oh! Ow, you dummies! Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks! Hey, you! Forget I said anything about magic! Mad Dummy is looking nervous. Talk to him. Talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. No one is happy with this. I'll defeat you and take your soul! Hey! Oh wow, Mad Dummy is doing an armless ska dance. I'm still gonna keep talking. Talk to the dummy. Yeah, it doesn't seem much for how okay, no one's happy. You're sold across the barrier, I'm guessing. Oh, he's moving! Oh, that's still not- that's still freaking. Mad Dummy is bossing around its bullets. This kind of reminds me of, uh, Napstablook's theme. I don't know why. I'll stand in the window of a fancy store. Alright, great. Mad Dummy- Mad Dummy is getting its cotton all over the dialogue box. A little longer than a few minutes later. Oh my god! Hey guys! Dummies! 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 Remember how I said not to shoot at me? Well, failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! Ha ha ha! Now you'll see my true power! Relying on people that aren't garbage! Mechanical whirs fill the room. You talk to the dummy. Don't see much. No one is happy with this. Dummy bots! Magic missile! Ow! Holy crap! Okay! <clears throat> Mad Dummy is doing an armless ska dance. Great. Dummy bot, try again! Oh my god! Ow! That was fun. Dummy bot, you're awful! Holy crap! What the hell do you ma- Ow! Why? Bruh! Two thousand years later. Why? There's no need for all this! Come on! Oh, you piece of- Oh yeah, that was a lot of damage. N no way. These guys are even worse than the other guys. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends. Oh, I've got knives! <laughs> Throw knives at me! Is that all you had? I'm out of knives. <laughs> he had one knife. But it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you. You'll be stuck fighting me! Forever! 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 Oh my god! <laughs> oh, oh, uh, oh! Oh, what the heck is this? Uh. Uh. Acid rain? Oh, forget it! I'm out of here! Bye! <gasps> Naps the book! Sorry, I, I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, the friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys looked like you were having fun. Oh no, I just wanted to say hi. Oh no, no, Naps is come back. Well, I'm gonna head home now. Oh, um, feel free to come with if you want. But no pressure. I understand if you're busy. It's fine, no worries. Just thought I'd offer. No, Naps look. wait, hang on, let me heal. Let me eat a bicycle. 
All right, let me just eat that other part of the bicycle. Nice. All right. Yay! Hey, my house is up here. In case you want to see, or in case you don't. All right. I'm gonna save it and uh, save. I'm recording for 57 minutes. I can play for a little bit longer, but I gotta go to the bathroom real quick. So I will be right back. Hey, what's good? Oh, 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 oh you really came. Sorry, 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 I wasn't sorry, expecting sorry, that. It's not it's much, not but make yourself at home. Oh, are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. Hey, this is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? Sure. You attempt to bite into the ghost sandwich. You phase right through it. Oh, never mind. After a great meal, I like to lie on the ground and feel like garbage. It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Sure. Okay, follow my lead. <laughs> Here we go. You'll lie down as long as you don't move. So, only move around when you want to get up, I guess. Alright. I'm gonna chill here for a second if you don't mind. Music's fading. What the hell is happening? Whoa! Did that ghost sandwich have acid on it? Well, well that was nice. Thank you. Hey, alright. You still need to recover after all that laying down. Hurt, beaten, and fearful for our lives, we surrendered to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians sealed us underground with a magic spell. Anything can enter through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. Huh. There is only one way to reverse the spell. If a huge power equivalent to seven human souls attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. Hmm. One second. I want to find the Temi village. But this cursed place has no entrances or exits. There is no way a human could come here. We will remain trapped down here forever. I'm gonna keep looking just to make sure. Oh. Special enemy Temi appears to defeat you. Feed Temi flakes. Temi all wants, only wants the Temi flakes. No, so hunger dies. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Temi, Temi vibrates intensely. Feed Temi flakes. Temi only wants the Temi flakes. No, so hungry dies. Temi forgot her other attack. Talk? Say hello to Temi. Hoi, I'm Temi! What the heck? Temi forgot her other attack. Yay! Spare! You won! What? Does that mean I'm getting close? Oh. Hoi, welcome to Tem Village. Hoi, I'm Temi. And this is my friend, Temi. Hoi, I'm Temi. And this is my friend, Temi. Hoi, I'm Temi. Don't forget my friend. Hi. I'm Bob. <laughs> you feel something. You're filled with determination. Hang on, I want to see this. Rich history of Tem. They're dragon tamers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. Should check Tem shop. Oh wow, 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 humans, such a cute. Yay, statue of Tem. Very famous. Very. Egg. Tem, watch egg. Egg will hatch. Tem, proud parent. Nice. Mushroom dance. Mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean? It symbolizes my inner torment trapped here in my hyphae. My struggles to pull away, my struggles to escape. But alas, to no avail. Great. Feeling of being watched. P Tem hood human allergics to Tem. That okay, Tem understand. Tem also allergic to Tem. Uh oh. Hives, uh, hives. Great. Uh, well then, what do you got in here? 
Hi, welcome to the temp shop. What? College, temp pursue higher education. Temp flake on sale. Oh, it's the same thing. All right. Uh, can I sell? I can sell. I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna pay for Tim's college. Yes. Whoa. That's a lot of muns. Can Tim really accept? Okay, it's Tim, go to college and make you proud. Oh, your face is gone. Or oh, your face is still there. Tim, back from co cool leg. Tim learned many things. Learn to sell new item. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Makes battles too easy. Armor 20 defense. Bruh. They don't have muns. I. I made a huge mistake with that. I think I found my way. What? Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters use crystals to navigate. Oh, ah, and bam, there we go. Uh-oh. Everything's still fading. I can't see nothing. Behind you. Oh, boy. Seven. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Hmm. Undying! I'll help you fight! Yo! You did it! Undying is right in front of you! You've got front row seats to her fight! Wait. Who is she fighting? Hey! You aren't gonna tell my parents about this, are you? Thank you, Monster Kid. Damn. It was like that? Okay. Nice. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. If I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me? Of course I won't laugh. Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Standing under the sky, looking at the world all around. That's my wish. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish, too. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface. They will return, and the underground will go empty. Get the feeling that that's me. Yo! What? How do you get places? How? What's up? Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? Haha. <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now. I mean, Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something? But I kind of stink at that, haha. <laughs> Yo, say something mean so I can hate you, please? Uh, no. Yo, what? So I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I, I hate your guts. Man, I, I'm such a turd. I'm... I'm gonna go home now. Oh... Yo! Wait, wait! Help! I tripped! 
Come on, get up, dude. There you go. Yo, yo dude. If if you, you want to hurt my friend, you're going to have to get through me first. <laughs> what? She's gone. She, oh, yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. <laughs> we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Don't trip. Alrighty then. Uh. How? Seven. Seven human souls, and King Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as it is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it! Why should I tell you that story? When you're about to die! Ah! Oh shoot! Oh damn! You! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams! Alpha's history books made me think humans were cool! With their giant robots and flowery swordsmen! But you? You're just a coward! Hiding behind that kid so you can run away from me again? And let's not forget your wimpy goody two-shoes stick! Oh, I'm making such a difference by hugging random strangers. You know what would do be more valuable to everyone? If you were dead! That's right, human. Your continued existence is a crime. Your life is all that stands between us and our freedom. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts pounding to get together. Everyone's been waiting their whole lives for this moment. But we're not nervous at all. When everyone puts their hearts together, they can't lose. Now, human... Let's end this. Right here, right now. I'll show you how determined monsters can be. Step forward when you're ready. Boo hoo hoo! Uh, the wind is howling. You're filled with termination. Undying arena. Alright, screw it. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come! Okay. On guard! Undying attacks. Undying check, challenge, plead. <laughs> Oh, spare. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Okay. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. Oh, God. Oh. Now he points her heroically towards the sky. Uh. Sh so, challenge? You tell Undyne her attacks are too easy. The bullets get faster. <laughs> Crap. Not bad. Then how about this? Oh, 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 oh. Yay. <laughs> Undying flashes a menacing smile. Challenge. Tell Undying's her attack are too easy. The bullets get faster. For years we've dreamed of a happy ending. Woo! <laughs> Smells like sushi. Ugh. Challenge. You tell Undying her attacks are too easy. The bullets get faster. And now sunlight is just within our reach. <laughs> I'm doing it. Undying points heroically towards the sky. Challenge. You tell Undyne's her attack are too easy. The bullets get unfair. And once you snatch it away from us. Oh, God. <laughs> Nine bounces impatiently. Can I... Challenge. Tell Undyne her attacks are too easy. The bullets get unfair. Nah, enough warming up. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, God. Undying suplexes... Suplexes a huge boulder. Wait. Flee! Escape! Oh! Oh! Oh my god, no! Alright. Oh god. You won't get away from me this time. Crap. I can't run! Challenge. Her attack gets faster. Honestly, I'm daring. Let's go. Undying suplex is a huge boulder. Come on, you're too easy. Too easy. No human has ever made it past Asgore. Oh, you piece of crap? Oh! Undying towers threatening me. You tell Undying her attacks are too easy. The bullets get unfair. Killing you now is an act of mercy. 
Oh, God. Wait, Undyne holds her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Cinnabon. XP was knocked out. So stop being so damn resilient. Ah, I'm so bad. Ooh, no. Damn it. <laughs> Undyne flips her spear impatiently. Okay, well, I'm just, you can be impatient. I'm running for my life. Oh, she's fast! You've escaped from me for the last time. <laughs> Dying attacks. Challenge. You're too easy! Elphus told me humans were... Okay, I missed that. Oh! Hang on, can I just spare? I see now what you meant by that. Ooh! I like that. It smells like sushi. But I'm determined too. Oh my god, dude, that is awful. Determined to end this right now. Undyne thinks of her friends and pounds the ground with her fists. Cinnabon. Right now! Right now! I'm dying suplex is a huge bolt. Come on, you're too easy! Ha ha! Ah! Oh. And dying draws her finger across her neck. You tell Undyne her attacks are easy. Yeah, die already, you little brat! Oh my god, really? Bruh! No! No! Nine flash and mannequin. Flee. Run! Run! I got one HP! Ring. Oh my god. <laughs> Papyrus. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking, you, me, and Undying should all hang out sometime. I think you would make great pals. Let's meet up at our house later. Click. Okay, I'm running, Papyrus. Thanks for that. Oh! Oh! I Oh, is she getting slower? Uh-oh. Uh, I can't move! Armor, so hot. But I can't give up. Oh my god, she's dead. She looks dry. Oh, is she a, oh she's a fish. It's a water cooler. Take a cup of water, you take a cup of water. I got... Wait, what? Give Undying the water? Yes. Pour it on her face. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> okay. Bye. Uh. Well then. Oh, Sans is gone. Where did Sans go? I wanted to talk to him. Oh, that's whack. Oh, hello there. Okay, K, K, K. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. Okay, great. Can I give you... Uh... Wait, hang on. Wait, what? Are you just carrying that around and looks so sophisticated? Because it's not working. Thanks. The water evaporated from the heat. The cup evaporated, too. <laughs> wow. All right. Seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. All right. Okay, yeah, great. What's down here? Ooh. Tralala, -la, I am the river man. Or am I the river woman? It doesn't really matter. I love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Ride in the boat? Sure. Where will we go today? Snowden or waterfall? Oh, oh. Okay, I guess we're going Snowden then. Sure! Sorry, Undying. Like, told us there was totally a human in the area, so, like, us royal guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Yeah, even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undying. Alright, oh, this is the laboratory it's talking about. Oh, alright, yep. <laughs> Unfortunately, I've been recording for an hour and 40 minutes, pretty much. So, if you guys did enjoy this episode of Undertale, I was about to say Undying, Undertale, uh, if you did enjoy this episode of Un Undertale,
please leave a like and comment down below and hit the subscribe button and that little bell notification so you know when I upload next. And I'll see all you lovely ladies and gentlemen in the next episode. Peace to the fallen.